Elva starts his winter tour of 1977 off with four dates in Florida. Today on Peyton Place, we're going to look at two special performances from two of those dates. Stay tuned. Welcome back to another Peyton Place. So glad you're watching these videos. So glad you like them. Share them with all your friends. If they say they like Elvis or you see them wearing an Elvis shirt, tell them about the channel. Share the videos with them. So guys, I've been going through my Elvis files looking for something that I thought you'd find interesting. I think I found two little performances that were share worthy. Wow. I'm going to share them with you here on Peyton Place today. So guys, today on Payton Place, we're taking a look at two performances from Florida. The first one is February 13th, West Palm Beach, Florida, 1977, Elvis doing Fever. Guys, Elvis is cutting up and in such a good mood, I just thought it was worth sharing with you guys, and we're going to take a look at that on Payton Place. The second video, guys, I believe is very rare, and I haven't been able to find any footage of it anywhere else, so hopefully... This will be very enjoyable to all you Elvis fans out there. And it's from the very next day, February 14th, of Elvis in St. Petersburg, Florida. It's Elvis doing Blueberry Hill, and it kind of has a funny story to it, guys. And I'm going to fill you in on that as we go along. All right, guys. Let's do it. Okay, guys. From West Palm Beach Arena in West Palm Beach, Florida... Here's that rare footage of Elvis in a great mood doing Fever. Okay, gang, so here's some audio of later that night. Elvis introduces piano player Tony Brown and he cuts loose on a rendition of Blueberry Hill. On this night, the key of the song is higher and Tony overpowers Elvis's voice with his playing. Evidently, Elvis isn't very pleased and in the video footage you'll see after this audio clip, you'll see the result of Tony's actions on this night. Oh, 
Okay, gang, so here we are the next night, and Elvis hasn't forgotten what happened the previous night when it comes to introducing his piano player, Tony Brown. If you watch and listen closely, Elvis tells Tony he's a fantastic piano player, but he's warped. Elvis scoots Tony over and shows him how to play it and proceeds to tell him it's not complicated, it's simple. Check it out, guys. That's it, guys. What you think about those red clips right there? Some really neat footage I thought we'd share with you guys. I know you'd like to see them as much as I enjoyed finding them. Woo! I couldn't wait to share them with you guys. Keep liking, sharing, subscribing. Tell all your friends about it. And as always, guys, keep watching. Awesome.